like throwing shrimp on the barbie. Except the shrimp is a bear and the barbie is me. This is the drop bear. Australia is home to some of the most horrifying creatures known to man. The box jellyfish with its painful sting that stops your heart. The funnel web spider, where male bites have caused 14 deaths. And the death adler, which I'm not even going to get into because it's right there in the name. Death. No thank you, sir. You can Google it yourself. Somehow, Australia's ecosystem has cultivated some terrifying monsters. So it should be no surprise that they took bears and just cranked that up to 11. Known scientifically as the Thylarctos plummetus, a large ursine is said to drop from trees high above and fall onto unsuspecting prey. They attack with elongated claws like cha and a maw of razor sharp teeth like said to be related to the koala, another asshole tree bear which I'm not going to get into here. They mainly live high up in trees, and their favorite flavor of human meat is me. Well, not me specifically, but me and anyone else who does not hail from the grand old down under. You'll have to forgive the horrid attempt at an accent there, but it could be the only thing protecting me from getting torn apart. There's actually several ways to avoid fist fighting a bear that's intent on drinking your sweet head juices. Some say you have to throw on the Aussie accent as drop bears are the respectable sort and don't eat anyone coming from Australia. Others say to avoid head trauma, you have to put Vegemite or toothpaste behind your ears. You know, to fool them into thinking you're a sparkly toothed Vegemite eating Aussie, 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 oi, oi, oi. There's also one last thing you can do to save yourself from drop bears. Piss yourself. Do it, nerd. You wanna be the chew toy of a toothy koala? Of course, it could just be the locals messing with you. But do you really want to take the chance when the alternative is bears? Thank you for watching Spooky Sushi. We want to give a shout out to all of our amazing patrons who made this video possible. To join them and get neat rewards, please visit patreon.com slash team And if you have something spooky you want me to look into, put it in the comments below. Until next time, Stay spooky.